All right, this is John Kohler with DiscountJuicers.com. We're here at the trade show, and it's closed up for the day. It's the last day of the trade show. Everybody's packing up in the background here. But, you know, before I left the trade show, I had to talk with this man right here. He is world famous. He's formerly known as the Juice Man. He's now the Juice Daddy. So many people might not know that I got into juicing in 1995 because I saw this man on an infomercial. And I bought the Juice Man 2 juicer off the infomercial. And that's how I got into juicing. It saved my life. So I'm really grateful to this man. I'm glad that I'm here to interview him today and to share with you his brand new Juice Daddy juicer. So, you know, you're gonna see a juice off here with the Juice Daddy juicer here soon enough. But, uh, you know, let's go ahead and let's talk to Jay for a minute. What foods are alive? What does the body need? Foods that are cooked, can the body handle them without having any toxicity and, and any putrefaction? Uh, the body needs raw food. And always remember, no matter what you eat, it's going to turn your body. Is. Your body's going to turn, the digestive tract is going to turn everything you eat into liquid. Because the food that's fiber, well, use the back bucket that we have here. You see this right here? This stuff can't get through the intestinal wall, through the villi, into your bloodstream to feed your under trillion cells. The juice that was locked in here, you have to release it, can get into your bloodstream. pre digesting You see, this, you're going to have to evacuate it in a bowel movement. This is going to have to come through you. This is necessary physiologically to exercise the gums, to stimulate the peristaltic action of 22 beats a minute. Some people have a very slow beat uh, of, of, and a very, very low retention. Some people have a slow beat of 10 or 12 beats per minute. Those are the people that are always constipated, have trouble. A normal bowel movement it evacuates what you eat, fiber and bulk, what you eat in about 24 minutes. A normal bowel movement takes two days, two and a half days. But the body, the body is a juice machine. Whatever you eat, the body has to turn it into the liquid. Because it isn't this that I showed you. It isn't the fiber or the bulk. It isn't this that can get through the intestinal wall. It was the liquid, the plant juice that the, bot, that the plant produced from the ground and solar energy and everything else that is locked in the carrots and the apples and the grapes and the pineapple and the spinach and the parsley. It's only the juice of, that's my slogan. Yeah, it's because juice of, of the fiber that feeds you. It's the juice of the fiber that feeds you. Tell me about this brand new juicer you came out with. Well, I thought a lot of people needed a stainless steel juicer. Okay. And they needed it for a, the right price instead of 300 or 400 or 500. So uh, always the, the kind of juices I had were all plastic, non-toxic plastic. But mm -hmm. I'm, a, I'm, a real, I'm a real aficionado of stainless steel. Okay. So I made this one, or had it made, I didn't make it, but I had it made. Stainless steel, I found the right company, great, great stainless steel blades, very durable and everything else. Stainless steel bowl like this, the motor's under here, it comes, all the juice comes out through here into your cup. Or, or okay. So I had this made, and I said, we've got to have a stainless steel juicer that's a pulp injector. Because when you make juices and you have a bunch of pulp stay inside the uh, spinning basket, now you have to unscrew it after a glass or two of juice, and you have to take your fingernails and dig the stuff out, or you have to shovel on this because it's lying, in, it's lying inside against, against that spinning cylinder. You know, ours ejects the pulp in a half a turn. I'm the one that invented the pulp ejector. I've had several pulp ejectors before this one. You've seen me on television with it and everything. But this one I made special, special to keep price down. This is the kind of juicer you want to have. Because if you have a juicer that's that's time consuming, the next thing you know you're gonna set it set it in the cupboard. Right. In the closet. Right. This one, I can make juices now, I we can leave here. I can come back three hours from now. And where the last juice I made was maybe my Christmas cocktail of, of grapes, uh, of slice of lemon peel and a couple apples. I can make spinach and apple. I can make spinach and carrot. I can do anything I want to. I don't have to stop and clean it out. This one, this is a perpetual juicer. You tell us about this large feed sheet. This juicer has a three-inch wide feed sheet, so you could just put whole apples and a couple yeah. carrots in at a time. I mean, do you yeah. like that new wide I feed sheet, Jay? I love it, and not only that, I put three carrots at a time. Okay. I put a hand fistful of spinach and everything else right through here, and celery four or five stalks at a time if I wanted to. And a whole orange goes on. If you peel it, a whole orange goes in there. You see, that's the beauty of a juicer like this. You're going to use it. I've got I've got so many juicers at home, and I don't need they're old old antiques now. Juices that I I started to juice with back in the 1940s and 50s. You know, 
Now, this is the juicer that we use. We put it on the counter, our boys use it, they love it. It's really easy to make, it's easy to clean, and it, it'll keep you making juices so there's not a beat that you missed but you make every single day of your life. Now, do you have to drink the juice right after you make it, Jay? Especially, Tell me about that. Especially cabbage, okay. because cabbage loses its potential potency within two to three minutes. Two to three minutes. Two so you should minutes. drink the juice two to three minutes right That's after right. you make it. Look at vitamin C. As soon as you release the vitamin C from the cells of an orange, within 10, 15 minutes, you lost almost all the vitamin C. It oxidates, it, it disappears. And that's why most orange juices say vitamin C enriched. <laughs> you see? Yeah, the vitamin C was there to begin with and they, and they have to add the vitamin C because oxidation alone takes its toll. When you, when you break open, when you break open any, any of these foods and all the juices are locked in little cellophane, like almost like a, almost like a balloon and it keeps all the nutrients in, 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 a, in a little cone, a little sheath. And so when you eat that, that's what the body has to digest. And it's important to digest to put fiber in your body. However, when you make juices out of it, most of the juice cannot come out you know, with the reamers and that type of thing. With this, we rupture every single cell and all the juice flows out. Besides just being a juicer, this is a two-in-one appliance. It's also a blender. And you I've know, I've never had this before. You know, they've done happened. the blender right. Let me show you. So you literally just take off this top piece here, and you can put this blender. Now this is the drive, This is the drive shaft. See, now you just drop it on there. You drop that blender on, and the thing I like about this blender is this blender is a solid glass craft. No plastic here. This is no, J Cordage. No plastic. Good quality glass, and. Uh, you can get a little uh, pusher here to help push things in to the now, blender. What I open this up for is when you're making, you have in here, you have your orange juice that you put in here, and you throw some pineapples in here, maybe a couple of strawberries. And the reason and you do it this way, you do it like that. Now what I did, I also opened up a little opening here. So if you're dropping your protein powder in here, you know, you don't want to splash back at you. So you're just dropping a little scoop of protein powder in there, whatever you need. So you have protein in there. That's what I do an awful lot. The, the blender is beautiful. I know I know people like to make milkshakes in here and all that. Uh, I'm not into that, you know. But the kids love it. Kids like it. It's, it's great for them. Hopefully you've learned more about the Juice Daddy Juicer today. Be sure to visit discountjuicers.com slash YouTube for special promotional offers for you.